Today, we're out in the Coeur d'Alene Chain Lakes, which are a series of eight lakes connected by channels to the lower Coeur d'Alene River near the town of Harrison, about an hour south of Coeur d'Alene. We've seen an increase in the number of bass that have been reported caught by anglers in lakes that we didn't release them in with tags. Each lake is currently managed as an independent fishery and has its own harvest regulations. If movements are occurring, this research will help us better understand how that could impact management options moving forward. We're using boat electrofishing to collect largemouth bass. Get weights and lengths and tag these fish while still being able to release them. Some of the bass in these lakes will be fitted with an acoustic telemetry tag that we surgically implant into the fish. That tag let us know if that fish stays in the lake or if it moves between the lakes. We're also checking and downloading our acoustic telemetry receiver data today. These receivers are placed in a location that the bass really has to swim past. Um, in order to leave the lake or to go into another lake. These receivers are collecting information through, across all the seasons. This research is a unique and proactive opportunity to test some of our management assumptions about the chain lakes, get out there, engage local anglers, get our hands on hundreds of fish and improve our understanding of these fisheries for years to come. Looking ahead, this research project is going to provide a really strong foundation of information that I think we're going to be able to use to address future questions or concerns for these fisheries beyond just our routine monitoring of the populations. My big hope moving forward is that we can ask the right questions and gather the right information to make sure that 5, 10, 15, 20 years from now, these fisheries are still producing amazing largemouth bass for everyone to enjoy.